Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. So as you can tell by the title, I'm trying a new brand. It is called Freya, but I'm pretty sure it's like Freya lingerie, but they do lingerie, they do active wear, and they do bikinis. And I've wanted to try them for a little bit now, so I went on the website, had some new styles on, and I made a purchase. So we're gonna start off with what I'm wearing. So this is the Jewel Cove set. I got the top in a 36 seat, it was 38 pounds, and I got the high leg bikini briefs. They were 23 pounds in a size extra large. So I definitely, kind of went and got some different sizes for these pieces just because I wasn't sure how it fit so the bikini tops are mostly all like bras and I hate bra bikinis but like these are actually really nice you can see it's very flattering I do feel like I definitely should have got maybe a 36d or a 38c just because it does feel quite snug like round this bit and my bra size would probably be about 36 but i've been getting 38 just for like more comfort really um but as you can see it's a halter neck there's no padding there's no push-up so it lifts the girls very well probably would say that they are maybe a bit more spilling out which is why i feel like i need to size up and just because like it's lifted at the bottom here so that's not anything they've done it's my fault but it is a halter neck and the back does have a little clasp, so you can't order the bust or anything um just the halter and then the bikini briefs are quite nice they are stretchy i do feel like an extra large actually fits okay for me there's like a bit more extra material they are a little bit more on the cheeky side i definitely think you can make them a bit more like cheekier so i'd probably kind of say they're like brazilian but yeah i really love this set i love the colors you guys know i love a bit of pink but i definitely feel like i need to change the size of the top and um, the bottoms again i think fit fine i do feel like it's very flattering and the main goal to see is, is this brand really plus size friendly because they go up to a K cup, I believe. And they do have like a range of sizes. So, so far, I feel like we're ticking the boxes. Just obviously make sure you get your true size or if you're not sure, maybe get a couple sizes and then you can send them back because they do have free returns and it is free delivery over 50 pounds, I think. Okay, so this next one was in the sale and this is originally the first bikini. I actually saw the bikini top on like Google, like in the ads and like sponsored kind of section and I really loved the look of it. So this is the check-in set. I've got the top in a 2X, uh, the top in a 38D, which was £22.80, and then the bottoms in a 2XL, £14.40. They do have a black and they do have like a sage. And I probably would have really liked the sage, to be honest, um, but orange was all they had left in my size. I think this is so cute. This is definitely more fitted than the other one, because obviously you get a 38D, so like the bust bit feels so much better. Um, I don't know if I would have needed a 38C, but I feel like I fit fine, like it holds me in. The frills are just like so cute. Again, no padding in any of these. And then it does have a clasp and the frills go around the back and then it does have adjustable straps. And then while I'm here, you can see that the bikini bottoms are more full coverage on this one. So they're giving a little bit more support on the stomach um, and I can kind of pull them high waisted. I will say these bottoms probably aren't my favorite. I do prefer the style of the other ones. They still fit great. Like again, for a 2X, they have like plenty of stretch to them. And I really like the set. I love like the gingham checked print. And I feel like orange again goes with like the hair and the skin tone. And again, it was in the sale. So it was cheap and affordable. These are very well made. Like there is nothing I can fault about any of these. They're just very nice quality. I do feel like they're cheap and affordable. Maybe wait till they have a sale or discount. But yeah, do really like this one as well. Comfortable, flattering. I don't know obviously how much the underwire would hold up like throughout the day or however many hours you're wearing it. But so far, like it feels comfortable. Like the girls are supported. This is the Santiago Nights. I got it on obviously Leopard. The top I got in a 36D. It was £40 and the bottoms are gone in extra large and they were £23. So not all of the bottoms I noticed go past an extra large. Really, they're not kind of catering to plus size. If they can do like a bigger bust top, they should be doing bigger bottoms as well. Um, because obviously we're all different proportions anyway. But as you can see, I've trialed different sizes. Um, 36C, 36D, 38D. I don't know if I've got a 30 8c here but so far i feel like potentially a 38c would work um but again like i fit okay in these like it's just more like the bottom half i definitely would feel comfortable in a 38 this print is so lovely um and again this style bra is nice it's kind of like your typical bra again no padding gives nice support the wires aren't digging in or anything like that you do have a class to get it done up and the straps are adjustable as you can see the bikini bottoms again are cheeky they're like a brazilian i definitely prefer this style bottoms i do feel like i would have been much more comfortable in a 2xl just because it's pushing out the fat here a bit but again i think in both pieces i should have got like different sizes anything that got an extra large that's the highest they went up to otherwise i would have got a size bigger um but yeah i really love the style of this the pattern's nice the color's nice but again lovely quality feels really nice it's well made so yeah another winner 
just pick the right size. This next one is the Castaway Island. I got the top in a 3060, it was 40 pounds, and the high leg bikini briefs, extra large, 23 pounds. So it's kind of weird because these bottoms like feel a lot more roomy than like the previous bottoms did, for example. I love the colours, I love the pattern, but I do feel like for some reason this washes me out a bit. Like I don't think the colours are quite for me but again lovely top it's kind of similar to that one i just had on it's like the bra style again no padding no support lovely like soft material stretchy adjustable straps um this bra bit actually fits a bit better it's actually sitting to my skin for some reason but again probably would have felt comfortable in a 38 again we've got the same like plastic clasp adjustable straps and then these bottoms are a little bit more cheekier but and they are a bit more like full coverage on the stomach which i kind of prefer not pushing the fat out too much. I can kind of wear them high-waisted, but I do feel like they they slip a little bit. But yeah, overall, it is, again, a really nice set. I just don't think the colour is great for my pale skin. Okay, so we have a little bit to unpack here. So the set I've got is the Santiago Nikes. I've got the high apex bikini top in a 3060. It was £42. And then the bottoms are just the bikini briefs. They are 2XL. They're £26. And then I did want to try another style top because obviously a lot of these tops on Freya are kind of like the same style. But this is the Halter bikini top, 3060, £38. But the problem is, like, I can't really do it because they've attached the strap onto this one. So, like, you can't even try it on properly. So it's kind of a bit silly. But this one actually feels quite big for a 36D. Again, it probably pushes the fat out. I don't know if I would go for a 38 in this size just because it is like comfortable, it fits. And it's really nice colours, like the supports there, it's actually sitting down. Like we've got nice thicker straps on this one. So I definitely feel like these are good for a bigger bus for sure. We've got the clasp again and the adjustable straps. And these bottoms are just awful. Like they are full coverage, but they're so like low at the back and I can't really like pull them up and high waisted how I would like to wear them they're just I don't know these bottoms just aren't doing it for me there's something about them like maybe this whole set is just like jinxed <laughs> from the get-go because I can't even try on the nice water top they're still stretchy and comfortable but again they're just like big at the back but I've got 2xl on the other ones and they're fine so sizing is just a little bit weird for me because some of these bras are fitting better like this is 3016 it's fitting better than another 3060 so like I just don't get it but like again it's still well made it's still nice like it's still flattering just this one isn't I guess like my favorite so my final thoughts they're all the bikinis I picked up really love this brand like I love the patterns I love the styles sizing is a bit off don't really cater to plus size completely like if you're not gonna make all your sets past an extra large in the bottom then you're not really plus size like if you can make bigger busts because pretty much all of these tops have a huge size range for the busts and the cut but yeah the bottoms are just lacking so that's something they definitely need to work on but overall i actually really love this brand like very fun prints very fun styles flattering they're going through a lot of like figures and body shapes um so yeah i definitely would purchase again i just need to get my correct size in um but yeah really impressed with the brand i will leave everything linked down below if you do want to check any of these out let me know in the comments below which was your favorite and if you've tried anything from freya before i'm gonna have to look at their active wear now i know that they have active wear i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did please don't forget to give it a thumbs up don't forget to hit that subscribe button and turn on your post notifications and i'll see you guys in my next video bye guys